I'm Dwayne Rolfs of Servants United Parish. I will be leading daily devotions with you. The basis for these daily devotions is from Christ in Her Home, a daily devotional series. The Bible readings are from the Revised Standard Version. For Friday, November 11th, our scripture is the 98th Psalm. O oh, sing to the Lord a new song, for he do, has done marvelous things. His right hand and his holy arm have gotten him victory. The Lord has made known his victory. He has revealed his vindication in the sight of the nations. He has remembered his steadfast love and faithfulness to the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the victory of our God. Make a joyful noise to the Lord, all the earth. Break forth into joyous joyous song and sing praises. Sing praises to the Lord with the lyre, with the lyre and the sound of melody, with trumpets and the sound of the horn. Make a joyful noise before the King, the Lord. Let the sea roar for all that fills it, the world and all and those who live in it. Let the floods clap their hands, let the hills sing joy to to get, sing together for joy at the presence of the Lord for he is coming to judge the earth he will judge the world with righteousness and the peoples will and the peoples with equity joy from knowing what you know oh sing to the Lord a new song verse 1 My daughter pursued career and other goals in her young adult years and had her first child when she was 39. Once she became pregnant, she didn't tell everyone right away, but we couldn't help but notice how upbeat she was. There's a certain joy that comes from knowing good news. The writer of Psalm 98 knew good news. Full of joy to overflowing, the psalmist was not content to rejoice in God alone. Instead, the audience was invited to join in the party. When even that was clearly not enough, creation itself was called to join in the glee. Let the sea roar and all that fills it, the world and those who live in it. Let the floods clap their hands, let the hills sing together for joy. Verses 7 and 8. The good news the psalmist knew was that God had done marvelous things. Verse 1, in the past. Thus, the psalmist had confidence that God would do marvelous things again. Our prayer. Lord, I rejoice in the good news you have shown me through Jesus. Amen. Please join me in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen.